Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry Fan64 here, and I apologize if this video, this video, is, the camera is unfocused. It's now time to do another unexpected VHS and DVD update for um, June twenty second, two thousand twenty two, which I got a boatload of VHS tapes and some DVDs for my front run, and a couple of. There are some that please don't laugh at me about. Let's start with the two clamshells. I will be getting rid of my old... I will be t getting rid of my old copy that the label's ruined. i keep this now. The 48th of the NI5. Good Barco, but nothing. This next movie I heard awful things about, but I will keep for the collection. I heard this is Dumbo's worst movie. This one did have promo material, but I tossed it out. January 12th, 1995. There is no print date. This one's in Fisherman Master Angler video series. Label no print date on this tape at all. And that Mission Impossible finally have this movie back in the collection. So, and label D 34 for the 996. And by the way, I, I am currently watching the movie Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, but I decided to do this video very quick. August 24th, 2002, and August 27th, 2002, so printed three days apart. Got Anastasia. The 12th of 1998. Got Dinosaur. Hopefully this is a real better copy. My old copy of this tape had coloring issues. November 16th, 2000. Got the Terminator collection. I do have the first Terminator on the HS, but I'll be getting rid of that copy now. I might keep it, we'll see. Here's um the Terminator. And here's the Terminator 2 Judgment Day. I have Terminator 2 Judgment Day on 4K. Both tapes are printed in the 39th of the night six. This one is directed by Kevin Costner, just like the movie um Dances of Wolves, which I have. September 26, 1998. This one, this one came in the case for Terminate Teenage Mutant Ninja 3 when I got it. There is no print date or weekend year code on this tape. Yeah. That point of no return. This has the cheesy shield case, but it has the boring shield tape inside. June 18th, 1997. I will update you guys if this has the cheesy shield. We'll see. Got Ancient Secrets of the Bible Collection in Noah's Ark. Stick label, no print date. This one I'm going to keep for the heck of it. This one I also have the 2001 DVD of. I will still keep both copies, even though this movie is not that great. Show me a video on the 7th of 2001. Well, I'm yet again. This one has the cheesy shield case, but it has the boring shield tape inside. February 12th, and night 7. I will check to see if this has the cheesy shield. It might or might not. And this is another HBO tape for my collection. One of two I got today. Former runner from Universal Video. June 1st, 1999. Seats a bit busted right there, but tape's the worst. Let me check the film strip. The film strip's in good condition. The wheels are extremely yellowed. The tape still works. And there will be a review for the movie, um... Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. This is Victor Victoria. Critical stick label print date is April 21st, 1994. And I checked all these tapes, they're in good condition. 
Next up, I got Conan the Barbarian. I do have Conan the Destroyer on VHS. I had the original 1984 release of that one. The 47 Midnight Night 9, 5. This one's caseless, but it is Tarzan and Jane. This one I cannot, I don't know where it's recycled from, but I will check. May 6, 2002. I will check after the video's over. This is from the producers of The Matrix, Romeo Must Die, and Exit Wounds. I've seen all three, but I have The Matrix and Exit Wounds on DVD. I don't have the Romeo Must Die. This one's a Columbia Tri Star on Cannon Tape, and this one is. A overseas film group movie. This one's also a form rental from Hollywood video, just like the sixth day, the 25th of 2001. This one's Silverado Special Edition, Collector Edition. I used to have this tape a long time ago, but I got rid of it for no reason. This one is a 2004 reprint, the 47th of 2004. Let me try someone can't reprint. Someone named Robbie used to own this tape, but it's mine now. Finally got another Mary Kay and Ashley Olsen tape. This one has a crack in the lens, but tape still works. September 15th, 1999. Mom and Dad Saved the World. This is another HBO tape. This one is a Warner Brothers movie. This has a nice shiny cover. Playable the print date is two print dates January 30th and February 1st, and that night three. So printed two days apart. So I gotta get this tape in the case. Next up, I got tape. This is my second Richard Linklater movie I have. The first one being, uh, what was it? Um, the second one being, the first one being School of Rock. This is a Lionsgate and a Trimark tape. Purchased from Blockbuster on December 15, 2002. I know a, one of my favorite YouTubers, Alex Aleva, who used to be flicks movies, loves this movie. This is my third Lionsgate VHS tape I have. The first two being Crash and God's End. January 21st, 2002 and March 11th, 2002. This next one's caseless as well, but it is... Own books that video get ready to read. I will keep this tape for the collection. There is no week in your code on this tape or print date. This next one's another. This is my second RCA climbing pictures on video VHS. I have the first one being the blue and the gray. Never heard of this movie. This one. Looks like it's a former rental, but it doesn't say what store. It's former. It's another former rental from Universal Video. The thirty fourth and nice knee six. So printed ten years before my VHS of of Mission Impossible, which I already showed. This next one's really rare. This is a UK VHS of Beauty and the Beast, and I got two copies of this one. The nineteenth of September of June. The nineteenth of June, nineteen ninety three. Again, June nineteenth, nineteen ninety three. I will keep this for a look. I don't know if it will play in my VCR. And here's my other, the other copy I got. November 7th, Net Night 2. This one's in a video land case, but it is G.I. Joe in the movie. But inside... This is the best from RCA Claim Pictures on video. This is a, looks like it's a demo tape. There is no week in your code or print date. This one says Home Alone 3. I don't know if it's Home Alone 3 or not. I'll have to test it. Next up, I got an, another pal tape. This one is Dance Workout with Barbie. I, don't laugh at me. I'm starting to like Barbie. This one has oversized reels. No print date on this tape. Next up, I got A Good Day to Die with the late Sydney Poitier. This is my only Vidmark entertainment tape I have. 
So this is another former note from Universal Video. So I got two former notes from Universal Video. November 10th, and then I have five. Next up, I got Tiny Toon Adventures, How I Spent My Vacation. I will keep this tape for sure. January 25th, 1992, and I don't see another print date. This one is Scooby-Doo's Croupus Capers, the other Scooby-Doo tape I got. September 21st, 2000. I got another copy of Toy Story 2. My third copy, August 11th, 2000. Dinosaur is an eyewitness tape. I do not see a print date on this tape. This one is Escape from Pressure, another HBO tape. Jan October 14th, 2000. I don't see another print date. We have three more tapes left before we move on to the DVDs. December 1st, 1999, finally the state back in question. Yes, I do like the Magic School bus. July 5th, 1999, here's the last VHS I got for this video. This one had the recording tab on it, which I broke off for obvious reasons. There's no code with near code, and the reels are extremely old, but tape still works. Now it shows some DVDs. This one, is for really, this one came out of four film set, but the discs were stacked. Here is Free Willy 2, which I have the VHS of. I got Free Willy 3D Rescue. And here, this one says Polly Pocket, but this is actually Free Willy 4, a Red Skate from Pirate's Grove. Cove. This is my only one premiere movie I have, the D. That's 2004 DVD. There's a disc. And that 2.0. I do have, this is the sequel, I believe, to the net, which I have on DVD. Here's this. And please don't laugh at me, I got Strawberry Shortcake. Dress Up Days. I do, I'm starting to like this show, actually. But Barbie Presents Thumbelina. Here's the disc. At Happy Feet. I do have the two film collection, but I might just get rid of that copy. It's not a place to case to use this. Got Elmo's World Head to Toe with Elmo. I used to have an Elmo VHS, but I got rid of it from the re I threw it away because it was not in the best condition. 1159 from Tarzan Video. This never heard of this movie. Got Hello Kitty 2 Animation Theater, Faraway Lands, purchased from Blockbuster on April 19th, 2005. Here's the disc. So two more left. Clerks. I do have to get Clerks 2 sometime. And the last piece of media I got today. So this one I have on VHS as well. This one I used to have on Blu-ray, but I got rid of it for no reason. There's disc one with the film and disc two with the bonus features. So that is it for my DVD VHS, my huge VHS and DVD update for um, June 22nd, 2022, in which I'll see you guys in my next video, which will be a movie review to Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. So I'll see you guys then. Adios.